to open another door. Open that door. Look, an emergency box from the once was. A rare sight. The once was? Is this like the before times? Because that, that... Oh, it's a crowbar! The Joker in me is pleased. Old word claw bar. Oh, yes. Ooh, ooh. First, get me. The one and me and the kid. Then you and me. Then the three of us. And then one with the crowbar. You say another word, I'll put one in your lap. Party pooper. No cake for you. Who's got a camera? Uh, good times. Good fucking times. Alright, well, anyway. Um, nope, I need to go this way. I got a claw bar, though. It's a thing. This is tile? This is like fucking linoleum? Fucking tile? I must be walking through the old that world. That pipe looks weak. The claw bar should come in handy. Okay, well... Is that a melee weapon, or...? Clencher Stabby? I have two of those. Can I use them both at the same time? Like, how do I... That's not my thing. How do I switch to the claw bar? Did I not pay attention when you were telling me about that? Gear. In this section, you can change equipment and weapons. Is that considered, like, a legit weapon, or what? Like, can I just crowbar people? Can I have cake afterwards? Cake is a lie. Equipping gear, circle icons, are part of the body that can be geared and equipped. Found or brought from vendors, your favorites can be saved to outfits menu. Oh, okay. Ow! Oh, wait, it's considered a consumable? Oh no, that's an it's an inventory tool. Old world claw bar. It what there's a number next to it. Don't know if I like that. Is it nope, don't think I did it right. This is a little slow. I don't really like that. Okay, is it... It's pinned? Okay. Oh, it sort of does it on its own and I'm just a dumbass! Cool. That's neat. Do I need to pull? Do I need... Oh, I'm supposed to square. I'm a dumbass, so... Dude, that should not have shattered like that. Even with the old school claw bar or whatever. Alright, well, I guess I'm just gonna go down Whoa. this hole. Because, you know, Alice in Wonderland and all that shit. You know, it's like, just go down the hole. Out of this place. No, really, I mean it. I just went down here. Oh, jeez, that is a fall into, question mark, probably tar pits. Same. They just, like, leave me an opening to walk right in. Okay, cool gonna reward me for exploring this time maybe please I feel like you forced me to explore here and now you're not rewarding okay you're not gonna reward me this time oh Jesus I can break physics and double jump which I already knew I could but they never told me I could until then I just assume game wise that's glowy I'm a little bit of the orcs uh, produce biomatter in their multi-organ that they shed under distress. Blobs that affect the cellular coding strands of um, any living being when absorbed, including you. Why don't I have a ranged weapon? Did it break? Right where it cuts. Uh, ah, fuck! I tried to block him. Jing. Perry, Jesus. Oh, what was my uh, kung fu thing? It was. Oh, I can't use it because it's uh. I need a a gun. I need a gun, and I don't have one. Nope, no gun. 
Don't know why. I guess I started with one and it broke or something. Or maybe I dropped it. Or Finish I don't know. Them. Finish them. Well, maybe I shouldn't have chosen the gun. Bio blobs. You absorbed a bio blob. These are points to you use to unlock mu mutations. You collect bio blobs by defeating morgues and finding containers in various places in the world. So those little centipede thingies that I don't like are bio blobs. Or they're, they have bio blobs. You can use bio blobs to unlock special powers at any time using the ex by accessing the mutations part of the menu. Ah! What's going on? Is everything okay? Huh. Alright, so... I have bio blobs now. Can I... I can just use them by going to the menu? I guess I can. Mutations menu. Go to the mutations tab to unlock psi powers, biogenetics, and upgrade your resistance. Says. So, moth mouth. Use moth mouth. Uh, press the input you have bound to the ability while facing an enemy. This will affect small human, uh, any small humanoid hit. Well affected, the enemies will attack their out. Wow, that's fucking useful. Is this the throw up thing? It does seem like it. It makes them go berserk, though. That's pretty useful. Vile bile. Let's use vile bile. Oh wait, I don't have enough. Oh, I don't have three. Um, press down on the input. Press down on the input. You have found the ability to make you speed toxic. Slush in the direction you're facing, infecting all of the enemies who hit. But it just looks like it hurts them. It doesn't look like it makes them do the thing I want. And that's sort of useful. Is this it? Is that... My mutations are sort of limited. Okay. Well, I thought the mutations would be bigger. Ooh, that looks cool. I, I remember seeing that. That looks neat. Um... Okay, but it does seem like... What? Is that the... The... Uh... Goron fucking roll? Or is it just a complete fucking Ninja Turtles reference? Turtle form to toggle turtle form while press the input you have bound the ability while on the slope. To exit turtle form, press the input again. Use the yeah, it seems like it costs way too much. And it doesn't seem to do anything but, like, let you ride down a slope faster. Like, is it causing them harm? It looks like they got pushed back a bit. Mud Punch. That's some fucking Naruto shit right there. Mucus Bubble looks badass. Storm Hop is basically the, uh... Ground Pound from countless games, you know, prototype has it with the elbow drop, and same for ult uh, Hulk Ultimate Slam, or Smash, I think. Rad Wisps. These are basically seem to be needlers, or you're using, uh, what are they called? Uh, D and D has them where you just like shoot them off magic missiles. So it's like it hits them. You can't avoid it. Doesn't do a lot of damage, but it will hit them, and they can't do anything about it. It's very unpleasant and annoying, and it's very good to use in certain select circumstances or just as a general first attack. Particles are pretty good, like radioactive damage, and all of them will be hit. That's pretty useful. What's this one? The mushrooms. Yeah, I saw people using this and they- Oh my god, look at that guy! He's bouncing between the three! That's fucking awesome! Even if it doesn't do any damage, just to be like, that's annoying. Okay, so I'm not gonna go with the throwing up thing, although I don't think there's really an option at this point. I think this is still sort of throwing up. I'm gonna go with this one. I only have three. I could wait for the fungi, but I'm not gonna. I think this would be a useful thing because I'm getting teamed up on, so I'll do that one. Wee wee. Okay, so I have to press the thing that I want while facing the enemy. It's like, um, 
a triangle, I guess. To use this, to use an ability, is it's bound to while pressing and holding L2. So it's just L2 triangle. Boom. Cool. And that gives me the ability to use that. And they just, I could just make them fight it out. It uses up my ability to dodge, but I won't have to dodge as much if that's the case. Could I have used this on Psy powers? I probably could have. Oh, nope, nope, nope. I need Psy points for that. Blaze. Oh, I can just fire breath? Oh, what the fuck? Dude, that looks so cool. To use Blaze, press down the input you have bound. Blaze will launch you forward and leave a trail of fire behind me. Oh, that's fucking awesome. I like that. I want that one. Dude! Basically, like, super speed or fire behind you at faster speed. It does not look like you're teleporting. It looks like you're traveling super fast. But I'm assuming that I'm not in the way. Alright. Well, that looks cool. And I did not fuck with my resistance. I've got one point, but I'm not gonna. Because I haven't had to deal with that yet. Alright. Again, this is gonna be another short one where I basically just upgrade. Because... I have something else I was planning on doing tonight, and it may be relevant now, so that's what I'm going to do.